right then. Well, I, I guess I guess it's time to start this. And yes, it's going to be a man. Yes. All right, I'm going to be oldest dude I can. Everyone says that this class is hard, but I don't, I don't know what they're talking about, you know. <laughs> My burial gift. Ooh. Let's go with Let's go with chameleon. Oh man. Oh my god. Oh. My character looks like he's already dead. All right. I mean like I don't want to spend too much time on this, but oh man, look look at this guy. Look at that. They still got the same loading screen except they added a three. So many times you're gonna die in the tutorial. Oh man, that frame rate. Oh. Ah, oh, it's beautiful. You know who needs a tutorial when Dark Souls holds your hand the entire game? Look at that! I wanted to. What is this? Turn back. I don't know. Last time I listened to that was in Dark Souls. It's a crystal, and it's alive. You know, like, there's no reason you should ever try and win a fight that you can't win. The true test of a Dark Souls player is to realize when you have been beaten, and, and when the enemy AI has stopped chasing you. Get the sword now? I would like if I got the sword. What the fuck? Oh no. Oh, I knocked him down. I didn't even know you could do that. Oh no. Oh no. Alright, so like. I beat, I beat the boss, killed him in one hit because, you know, there's a glitch where if you get the stick of camouflage and walk up to him, then he dies. And he also gives you all this stuff. Like, all this stuff. He even gives you more sticks. Um, y you get the point. Oh, wow, look at this. It's an area that I've never seen before. Ooh, open menu, you know, like, oh, now which one of these shows who I truly am? I don't want to get up. Alright, so then you head up here, and then you one hit these guys because you're amazing at the game. These guys too. And then you miss them. He misses you too. So then you just kind of come up here, and whoa, look at this! It's Firelink Shrine. Then you just roll off there. And make sure to do that. Well, who the hell is this? I never seen you hmm. before. You're an unkindled yeah, shut the fuck. All right. So then you get to this bonfire. It's only like you know you travel that, then you get here, and this is the next boss. Yeah, they really ran out of ideas. I mean, he's just a giant crab. You know, I wonder if that would be useful for fighting this thing. I mean, it can't talk. So what if you talk to it? Like, would it, like... It would get all mad. Alright. Let's try this again. Jump. Hit him. Don't die immediately. No, you don't get this stuff. Hey, crab. Yeah, it's not working. <laughs> Doggy, no. You know, I wouldn't have been right there. I don't really feel like that. 
All right, boom, done. We go back. Where the hell did the crab go? Alright, so what I did know is that if you kill the undead doggo, then giant crab dude gets sucked into a portal straight to hell. And he doesn't come back. He's dead. He did it. You beat him. Also, your game slows down a lot. Who's this dude? Oh, that dude's rolling towards me. What oh, are dead. you doing in my swamp? Oh no. Oh no. Better out than in, I presume. <laughs> Those are the slam bros. Oh. He, he comes back.